Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to answer a question. And question is, what is default isolation level set for SQL Server instance? Uh, by default, in SQL Server instance, the isolation level is read committed. And that read committed isolation level, uh, if you turn into numeric, uh, it's number two. And I'm going to write it down here. Uh, number two, when I say number two, if you uh, uh, wanted to know what isolation level uh, of a particular transaction is, then you use dynamic view um, that is out there. And dynamic view is dm underscore exact underscore session. And if you select asterisk from that view, you will see the isolation level of a particular transaction of a particular session. So if you see number two, there it, it doesn't really say uh, read committed or read uncommitted or uh, snapshot or whatever the isolation level is it gives you number so if number you see two that is read committed and that is uh, uh, default isolation level of SQL Server of all the transaction that comes to SQL Server unless specifically defined uh, from the developers or from the application that transaction uh, uh, isolation level may be different from read committed but that needs to be specified in particular transaction i hope it helps